Pat's is more than just a cheesesteak. One of the timeless disputes in Philadelphia is of course which cheesesteak is better between the two cheesesteak kings, Pat's and Gino's. You're gonna get a, p a bunch of different answers because, you know, the cheesesteaks are like little different styles. I don't know, more meats on one, more cheese on the other, like whatever, but one thing that you always gotta remember, you always gotta keep in mind, is that the cheesesteak was invented by Pat. Uh, I went down to uh, Pat's with my dad. He took me uh, before a Phillies game. He went and I got my first cheesesteak. I remember a whiz wit. It was delicious. Um, ever since we've been coming back um, before like Eagles games or Phillies games, my dad will take me. We go together with the family too sometimes. And uh, it's actually tradition because his dad, uh, my grandfather, would take him down to Pat's too when he was young. My dad even taught me how to order because the uh, the cashiers, if you don't get the order right, then they're not having any of it. They'll send you to the back of the line. It's just a two-word phrase. It's very easy. One part's indicating the cheese, what kind of cheese you want, and the other part is to clarify if you want onions or not. All right. So for the first part is the cheese. Uh, really simple. Just gotta say, like, uh, if you want American, just say American. If you want Provolone, say Provolone. Say Wiz, say Wiz. Um, the second part is, is the, the difficult part. Um, you have to say, to indicate whether you want onions or not, you have to say wit or without. And you have to say wit or without, because that's the Philly way to say it. So if I want a, if I want a, a cheesesteak with Wiz cheese, cheese Wiz, and onions, I say, can I please have a Wiz Wit? Get two Wiz Wit, please. Two Wiz Wit, thank you. I almost feel like at home every time I come here, you know? I feel united with my Philadelphians and Eagles fans, you know, Phillies fans. It's like the, all the whole communities out here. Uh, I even saw my next door neighbor today. I always see a big face head. things seem to change but with Pats it's different. Pats is timeless. It stayed the same after all these years. When I carry on the tradition of bringing my kids to Pats before sports games, uh, we can experience it the same way my dad and my granddad did. 